and they are growing like crazy. But he is pulled. Stop it! So I'm really excited to keep Dahlia in my herd and continue these awesome genetics that Divine has brought into my goat herd. everyone this is Sylvia with Silver Pine Kiko Goats and it's been a while since I saw you last so sorry about that I've been very busy but in today's video I thought I'd just give you an update on all of the adorable little babies that have been born on the farm so I'll be telling you about each of the baby goats and how they're doing and first off I will start with Divine's triplets the babies that were born first so believe it or not, they're already about a month old. I know, it's crazy. Time has flown by so fast. Um, her firstborn is right here. He's the little guy that I'm holding. This is Diggory, and Diggory is doing awesome. Um, all of Divine's triplets have been doing amazing. Um, Divine has been a fantastic addition to my herd and I just couldn't ask for more as far as her overall uh, body conformation and how well she is taking care of her kids. So she and her babies are doing awesome and I'll grab her other two. So here is Domino. Domino is Divine's second born. This is another little buckling. I forgot to add that Degree did turn out to be horned and he also has wattles and Mr. Domino here is pulled. Um, Diggory is actually going to go to another farm when he's weaned and become a herd sire. As far as Domino, um, we're not quite sure yet, but he is pulled. Stop it! But he is pulled which is pretty awesome and that's Domino. Next up out of the triplets is Dahlia. She's actually pulled. Here's little Dahlia. And I actually plan on keeping Dahlia. So I'm really excited to keep Dahlia in my herd and continue these awesome genetics that Divine has brought into my goat herd. So next up is Mr. Link.
And Link is actually doing great. At first, if you saw Luna's kidding video, um, Link was having some trouble, but luckily he's doing awesome now. So Link and Lupin, his brother that I'll show you next, are both gonna be weathers, but these are awesome, sweet big boys. So they're doing great. So here's Luna's other buckling. This is Lupin. He's such a gorgeous little dude. Um, but Lupin is the biggest of the two boys. He's a big old boy. And they are growing like crazy. So Luna's boys are huge, but they are doing awesome. Huh. All right, you can go. And next up, I'll bring Kiko's triplet dolings, which were the last ones that got born. So here is Kiko's firstborn doling. Um, they actually just got named, so I will put her name in the text below. You'll be able to see what she got named. But she is an adorable little doling. All of Kiko's triplet dolings are just gorgeous, and I'm really excited to see how they turn out as does for people's herds. So there's that little girl, and she was the first one born. Um, all of the triplets are doing great, and Kiko is being an awesome mama. Here is Kiko's second doling that got born. She's actually the biggest one of the bunch, but she's pure white, and she is super sweet and friendly. Aren't you? Yeah. So she's always the first one of the babies to come right up to me as soon as I come to the pen. She's just really, really sweet. And she's a big girl. She's growing fast. So here's the smallest one of Kiko's dolings. She is the cutest little thing. And she's super friendly also. She just has the sweetest face though. So as I said before, these youngest triplets have just barely got named, so I will put their names in the text below. But all of the babies this year are doing amazing. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video today, uh, meeting these new little baby goats that we have on the farm this 2022 kidding season. Please don't forget to hit the like button, go down subscribe, press the notification bell so you don't miss another video, and I will see you on the next video.